and how you got involved in the beef industry. Okay, so I'm Demi Daniels, and I grew up on my family farm. We've always raised cattle. My grandparents have had cattle, so I guess I've just been around it my whole life. So, what yeah. type of cattle? Angus. My dad's got some Herefords, too, but mostly Angus. Yeah. yeah. Nice. I like the breed. So what do you plan on doing upon graduation? Um, I haven't quite decided yet, but go home. There's always a family farm, my grandpa's ranch. Probably help out with that when I can. Um, maybe work at a feedlot or any type of cattle operation. So. And you're kind of a special student because you're not only involved in our program, but you're also involved in heavily in the equestrian program. You help out with the equestrian team. So yeah. tell us a little bit about that and how you manage your time. Um. It is a little bit difficult. I am taking a lot of credit hours, but a lot of the staff, all you teachers, help me quite a bit, kind of balancing it. Like, it's really not as hard as people think it is. I mean, I get my work done, and all the activities I get to do on both sides of the farm are rewarding in the end, so I really enjoy it. So, what's your favorite thing about the beef program? Um. I'd say just like learning in a different way, like compared to back home. Um, a lot of the stuff you guys do here, my dad doesn't per se to do it that way, but um, just seeing how other operations operate is, I really enjoy that. So. Yes. And then you can take back what you want. And yes. Find found helpful, and then decide maybe that wasn't, won't fit your operation. Yeah. What's your be what's the best memory you have from being in the beef production program? Um, I really enjoyed feeding weeks. Um, Kyler, he was a joy to be around. Um, learned a lot from it, just seeing how you guys feed compared to how I feed back home. It also kind of was a little bit of home getting to feed cattle. It was kind of more real life stuff going on, so I really enjoyed that. So how do you feed back home? Like, how is it different? Than just different here? rations. I mean, same system we got a yeah. feed wagon tractor but gotcha. just yeah different yeah. feeds cool. so what was the most beneficial thing you learned or did rations that was one of my favorite things to learn about getting to see what actually helps grow cattle i mean compared to what we feed back home like i said it's just i really enjoyed learning about that yep and here there's a whole bunch of different rations going Yep. Especially when the bulls are here and having yearlings and two-year-olds and then yeah. have her rations. Yeah. So you definitely get familiar with rations. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> What's one life lesson you learned that will carry on with you? To be flexible is what I said. Um, nothing goes as planned. It's never going to be the way you think it's going to go, but just go with the flow. Yeah. Especially with livestock. I mean, nothing's going to work out the way you think it's going to work out. Yep, that's true. That's a very good life lesson to know and prepare you for rolling yeah. with the punches. <laughs> so what's the hardest thing you did but had the most reward, had the most rewards during your time at Florida College? Um, balancing both of my majors and also, like, Calf checks, obviously when I'm at home, I was doing schoolwork, but like doing calf checks, balancing schoolwork while also balancing another major. I mean, just having time for it all seems like there wasn't enough, but there was. I mean, I made it through it, so. Yeah. Must have good time management. I try. <laughs> so what piece of advice would you want the students after you to know about? Um, just because you don't agree with something like that's happening on this operation compared to like one that you did back home or it's different like doesn't mean it's necessarily wrong it's just a different way of learning so that's what I would say. Open. Yep, open-minded. How is the beef production program instrumental in your growth and preparation for your future career? Um, they gave me a lot of insight to a lot of different um, topics about like the beef industry like Calving season was so much different than I w than it was for me back home. Um, feeding, like I said before, just the way this whole operation works is a lot different than a lot of places from where I'm from. Like, we're very small. I mean, it's small. We're here, but, like, 
we kind of go on a bigger scale because we're all commercial cattle and we got registered cattle here. So learning like that way was a little different, but I enjoyed it. Yeah. yeah. So tell me something special that just happened to you. Uh, I got an award at our banquet the other night for being an outstanding Trojan. So that was something really cool. Did you cool. expect that? I was not expecting it, if I was being honest. Uh, yeah, well, um, tell us a little bit about that award and what it means to you and why you think you got it. Um, I'll have to think about this. It does mean a lot to me. It, I recently did have my grandma pass away, so it's kind of something that she always seen me doing better than I always seen myself doing, so like getting that award, I really thanked my grandma for it and pushed me to kind of keep going. That's really what pushed me to be the best I could be, do what I can for people. She was always pushing me and making me kind of, yeah, do things I can for people. That's really, I have, there's so many other people that have a lot less, so I try to just do what I can for when I can. Um, something special about Demi, because there's a lot of tremendous things about about you and um, obviously because you got that award for the beef program uh, something that comes to mind when I think about you is when we were torching cattle so we torched a few in class and then Demi and a couple other students didn't have anything going on over the weekend so decided just to come out and cook cattle um, just because that's what they wanted to do and got it done before sale that was my first time I've ever torched bull. It was really cool to learn from Emma and a lot of the other people that came out, and Marty even. I mean, I really enjoyed it. It's pretty cool. This girl is going to always step in and Come try do a it. good job. So, something special about her. Thank we you. appreciate you <laughs> deciding to take on the beef program as well. The horse beef program. Okay. Blessed to have had you. Thank you. <laughs> Don't think so. Okay. Good job.